Greetings, I'm Ricky R. Levon, author of the book Stir Up the Gifts, a Bible study on the books of 1st and 2nd Timothy. There is a process in designing and crafting a cover, but I will say that it's fun. The first cover was going to have a silver look, as you can see. It was to reflect something about gifts or sparkling, plus it was also meant to be different than any of the other book covers that I currently have. Because I did start noticing that there was a, let's just say, sameness to the books. So the goal was to make something different. Nevertheless, it's better to have choices. So a purple cover was introduced because this made it much, much different. Also, it highlighted the stir, as you can see in the swirling part, and stir of the gifts. However, the Space Odyssey is cool, but really wasn't sure if it was related to this book then there's the ancient town of Ephesus this is where Timothy actually ministered and there are some fantastic and great artifacts and ruins there to enjoy this spearheaded the idea to use the ruins as a primary picture for the front and back of the book basically the cover is a wraparound when you get the book you'll see what I mean so the yellow burst was added for a little pizzazz to the image but later that was changed to white then I noticed that the title was hard to see. Actually, it was my mother who said, hey, I can't see this. So it was like, okay, let me change the title from white lettering to what you see now. now. As you can see, there's a lot of changes that can happen when creating a cover for your book. The idea is hopefully to make it the best possible cover, but if you're designing or working on anything, have fun with it. Make changes, go out there, try different stuff, and see what can work. Well, that's it for now, but don't just enjoy the outside of the book. Look inside and get a copy today.